Okay, welcome everyone to your ECMWF 42 day forecast. Uh, and we're going to be looking at what the ECMWF is saying for the next six weeks and onwards. So, this is week one, the 3rd to the 10th of February 2025. And we're looking like this. So, we've got high pressure sitting to the north, northeast over the country. Low pressure in the Atlantic, low pressure is the far east. We're bringing in around that low pressure, a cool easterly, I should suspect. Precipitation charts based on that looks like this. Um, we're drier than average, except for the far north. Um, what, a little bit drier than average? Uh, yeah, it will be quite dry with that one. Um, temperature anomalies uh, drier for Ireland and the north of Scotland, but most parts of the UK are quite cold with them easterly winds coming in. We'll take a look at that. ECMWF goes cold for week two. Uh, week one, I mean. Week two now is the 10th to the 17th of February. And we're looking like this. We have got high pressure sitting to our north and east. Low pressure south winds are in from the east there. We are very close to bringing in a real beastly with all this cold area. If that low pressure is a bit further north, it would be crazy. With that one. Um, precipitation anomalies based on that, like this. Um, so we are drier than average once again. Um, temperatures look like this. Take a look at this. The whole of the UK, except from the far, far north Scottish islands up there, are very, very cold. Look at that. ECMWF picking it up. There will be some wintry showers with that as well, because... The high pressure are anomalies, not just like the actual high pressure, so. Take a look at that. You see MWF going cold. Dun, dun, dun. Week three. High pressure still blocking around Scandinavia. Um, low pressure in the Atlantic. This is a close one because we've got westerly winds coming up there. We've also got easterlies there. It's where the borderline is. There's going to be a lot of snow. I would expect a lot of snow with that one. Um, that will be a very tight, especially at times, I would think. Um, Weak. Precipitation anomalies look like this. We are going a little bit wetter than average. Which shows a potential of some snow. And as you can see, we are around average. So some snow would be possible there with week three. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, week four. Interesting once again. Low pressure in the Atlantic trying to come in. And we've got the easterly winds at the same time. Precipitation anomalies look like this. So yeah, we're at round average. There. Temperatures do go above average, but I don't think that'll be the case on the surface. As we've been very, very cold. And also, the easterly is still coming in. Um, week 4 and 5, we're not going to take much notice to because we do go a little bit, you know, unreliable. Who subscribed? I can't see. Did you hear that noise? Uh... I don't know. I couldn't see it. Right. <laughs> anyway, once again, precipitation for week four is above average, and week five is also around average. And temperatures for week four look like that, milder than average, and five. But don't take that too seriously, because that's way too far off to be correct. 
Okay, we are done with your ECM WF 42 day forecast. Thanks for watching.